Next thing you heard, they had some nuns sitting up in the bleachers. They come running out of the bleachers. Stop the scrimmage, they're animals. Stop the scrimmage, they're animals. We weren't animals. We weren't animals at all. We did it the loving way. Tonight, the Hall of Fame committee is represented by members Athletic Director Julie Renner, Assistant Athletic Director Kevin Taylor, representing the school administration are Superintendent Chad Hilliker, Principal Chris Clays, Assistant Principals Molly Connaughton and Adam Wickline, Bob Fuzon Jr. Bob graduated from Loveland High School in 1977. Bob played football his sophomore, junior, and senior years. He was team captain his senior year, claw man his junior and senior years, and tiger man, which was most valuable player his senior year. Bob was honorable mention all EHL both his senior and junior years. Bob also played baseball during his sophomore, junior, and senior years, where he was first team all EHL his sophomore, junior, and senior year. All Cincinnati Post his sophomore, junior, and senior year. All Cincinnati Inquirer his junior and senior year. Bob played in the East-West All-Star Game his senior year. Bob went to Motlow State and Middle Tennessee State where he played baseball. Bob now resides in Loveland with his wife, Felicia. Ladies and gentlemen, Bob Fuzon, Jr. <laughs> Next inductee is Charlie Carpenter. Charlie attended Loveland High School from 1964 to 1968. While at Loveland, Charlie played three years of varsity baseball, four years varsity basketball. Charlie also played four years of varsity football, where he was team captain both his junior and senior year. He won the Clawman Award his sophomore, junior, and senior years. He also won the Tigerman Award for Most Valuable Player both his junior and senior years. Charlie was first team all EHL his sophomore, junior, and senior years. He was first sophomore ever to name first team all EHL. Charlie was all district his junior and senior years and all city his junior and senior years. Charlie was an honorable mention Cincinnati Post Inquirer All-Star his sophomore year and with first team offense Cincinnati Post Inquirer All-Star both his junior and senior years. Charlie attended Murray State University where he played four years of football. He is currently employed as assistant football coach at Bethany College in Kansas. He resides in Loveland during the off season with his wife Vicki and enjoys spending time with his son and daughter, their spouses and five grandchildren. Ladies and gentlemen, Charlie Carpenter. Coach Roger Muthing. Roger is receiving the Hall of Fame Athletic Achievement Award for his 30 years of coaching at Loveland High School from 1969 to 1999. While at Loveland, Roger coached as an assistant varsity football coach for eight years, seven years as defensive coordinator, head JV football coach for two years, JV assistant for two years, freshman football coach for two years. Roger coached JV baseball for two years, freshman basketball for four years. He also coached as an assistant varsity basketball coach for one year for an undefeated team. Roger coached varsity golf for 12 years where he coached the EHL Player of the Year in 1993 and 94. His team was EHL champ in 94 and had an individual state qualifier in 94. Again in 96, his team was SBC champ and had another individual state qualifier. Roger was EHL and City Golf Coach of the Year in 1994. Roger also served as Loveland's Athletic Director from 1979 to 1983. During this time, Loveland had a state qualifier in swimming in 1981, 82, and 83. Roger retired from Loveland in 1999 and presently lives in Sycamore Township. Roger has one daughter, Pam, a son-in-law, Mike, and three grandchildren, Jack, Emma, and Hannah. Ladies and gentlemen, Roger Muthing. Ladies and gentlemen, these are Loveland High School Athletic newest members. Please give them one more round of applause and thank you.
Charlie, every kid my age, we were um, not too much younger than Charlie, but growing up, we said, man, we want to be like Charlie Carpenter. We want big and strong and fast and good. Uh, you can see I didn't make it. <laughs> there's a lot of tradition here. Boy, there's great, you know, the football program is great. We've got a great basketball program. We've got a baseball program. we got a soccer program. Wrestling program is great around here. So the pride and the tradition, no matter what sport we have here, there's great tradition, great pride. And that says a lot about where you're from, and especially in Loveland. I do believe that I have the product of great coaching. My father he came here to Loveland because of the same reasons that you said. He left the city, he seen Mr. McCoy, like the way the programs work, and here we were. I'd like to say thanks to everybody who committed. This has been a, you know, probably the best award. I know that it is the best of thing that I ever received. I'd like to thank the Loveland High School Athletic Department, the Loveland Athletic Boosters, and Hall of Fame Selection Committee for this award. I'd like to give special thanks to Kevin for his work for reestablishing this Loveland Athletic Hall of Fame. Great job. Sincere thanks to all those coaches and athletes without whose positive attitudes and skills, I wouldn't be receiving this award. As I looked at the 40 plus uh, Hall of Fame plaques, I realized that I'd had the good fortune to have coached, worked, or coached with or for half of those individuals represented on this class. My 30 plus years at level were the greatest. All right, thank you very much. Yeah, we are. <laughs>